If you, like me, were once a child, then there's a decent chance you also grew up watching The Wiggles. My childhood is flooded with memories of re-watching my original Wiggles VHS tapes over and over and over. And I think, like a lot of people, because they are some of my earliest memories, it honestly feels like they partially raised me. Forming in Sydney in 1991. The biggest children's entertainment group in Australia, if not the world. The Wiggles. 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 The Wiggles quickly became the most popular children's performers in the world. They made albums and TV shows and movies and toured for years. And eventually, most of the original members retired, passing on the torch to new Wiggles members. And while they have a whole new generation of young fans, in 2016 they did something unexpected. The original four Wiggles got back together to perform an overage rock concert for all their young fans who had now grown up. Since then, the original members continue to occasionally come out of retirement to perform at concerts and festivals. And this past year, they even hit number one in Australian radio with their cover of Elephant by Tame Impala. So when we started organising our Australia adventures, we knew we had to do something around the Wiggles. And that's when Tristan, who has some performing experience of his own, had an idea. Let's challenge ourselves to become Wiggles in a day. The mission would be to get the costumes, find a venue, write an original children's song, and perform it on stage in front of an audience, all within 24 hours. And just to take it one step further, we wanted to try and do it all with one of the original Wiggles. So Mary uh, is very keen, his words, to do it on Wednesday. He said we could come to his studio and his house and make a song and then perform at a local venue. Would yeah. he perform with us or just record? He would perform with us, yeah. Oh shit. Are we going to Sydney tomorrow? We gotta go yeah. book some flights. So now that we had Murray Cook, one of the original Wiggles, on board, it was time to prepare for our performance. I think there's one thing we need to do though. What? Look at all of our shirts. Wait, this is not... These are also colourless. Can I be purple? Oh, I wanna be yellow. Can I be green? There's no green. Uh, don't even think about being red. That'll piss Murray off. <laughs> to show up to Murray Wiggles' house <laughs> in his attire. I'll wear red. Oh, oh shit. shit! Can we play Wiggles songs? Give me one second. Hot potato, hot potato. Potato, hot potato. Hot potato, hot potato. Hot potato, hot potato. Mashed banana, 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 banana. Banana. Mashed banana. Alright, me and Cameron on a mission to find t shirts so that we can look like the Wiggles. Yeah, this was all day doing this. Plain white tees secured. Alright, we're in the craft store. We're here to buy the infamous colour dye for the shirts. That, that is the Wiggles. <laughs> what do I do for a living? <laughs> I'm just supposed to edit video. <laughs> the shop lady was just like, oh yeah, you can do it yourself. It's not that hard. It'll take you like a week. A week? Lady, I'm gonna be a Wiggle in like 12 hours. So Tristan, in post, can you edit this so it looks yellow? Yeah. Oh, oh my <laughs> god, I'm Cam Wiggle from the Wiggles. We should. Oh. Nice. Whoa! <laughs> what the hell are we doing? Whoa. He wants me to put this whole pod into the washing machine? That looks wrong. Throw it in there. On. Right? <laughs> you did it! You f***ed up, you made the mistake! <laughs> did I put the wrong color in? I meant to do yellow. I did the red and large. You're lying. Yeah. Why'd you do that? Wait, you pressed me, you pressed start! Tommy, what the hell? Are you Tommy, choking? what the heck? It's fine, guys, it's totally fine. But I'm red. Not anymore. <laughs> wow. We're just gonna roll with this. I guess I've got to square up against Murray. Wait. Hot potato, hot potato, hot potato, hot potato. Alright, you wanna see it? Yeah. Wow! Why is it a real red shirt? Whoa, whoa, your screen's not really broken. Also, this video is not meant to sound this dark and scary. Let's rewind five seconds, make it a little more fun and playful, exactly how this video should be. Why is it a real red shirt? This is the importance of music when it comes to editing videos here at Yes Theory and Seek Discomfort. And speaking of music, I wanted to take a moment to thank one of the best websites we use and the sponsor of this video, Musicbed. Musicbed is our favorite place to find music for all of our projects and films such as... 
Project Iceman. And when it comes to YouTube, higher production value normally equals more likes, views, and engagement. So therefore, when we use Musicbed, we don't only have a good story, but we have better all-around success with our video. And if you're curious to see what music we use, check out our Yes Theory and Project Iceman playlist, which we actually left links to in the description. And speaking of our recent documentary, Project Iceman, take this scene, for example, that you're looking at right now. We actually got the score for it directly from Musicbed. And you can see how impactful the scene is with powerful music. And just for fun, here's the same exact scene with different music. Sorry, Omar. So hear the difference for yourself and sign up for a free account. And use code YESTHEORY at checkout to receive one month free when you purchase an annual subscription. Okay, now back to the Wiggles video. I kinda like bananas. I like to eat apples in the sun. I like that a lot, Tristan. I dare I say it. Cause I'm a chicken nugget. Okay, something I've been doing a lot of lately to come up with ideas is like using AI. So I just used ChatGPT and said, give me new song titles for Wiggles songs. Let me know if anything like sparks your interest. Fun at the beach. <gasps> we love I'm it. having fun at the beach, I'm having fun at the beach. The Wiggly Twist. Dancing in the kitchen. Um, hey, dancing in the kitchen could be fun. That's yeah? cute. Can, can you sing Dancing in the Kitchen? Uh, play something. Yeah. Dancing. Dancing in the kitchen. All right, what's the chorus? I'm dancing in the kitchen, hoppity hop now, I'm dancing in the kitchen, hoppity bop. <laughs> Okay, so someone lay that down. So we have one song. As we continued trying to write a song, we didn't realize that Murray had been working behind the scenes to find a venue for us to perform at. They locked in the Duke, which is a pub right next to Murray's house. <gasps> wow. The owner is very keen for this. They have a drum set, PA system, full stage, and a green room for town. <laughs> so with a venue locked in, we made a call out on the Yes Theory Instagram which you should follow, by the way, to invite Yes Fan members to come down for our mystery performance. Tomorrow's the day we officially become Wiggles. And now that we have our uniforms in order, it's time for us to do some research. Wow. <laughs> wow. Wow. Ready? Do the wiggle. Do the wiggle. No cam. Do the leg. Yeah. So Sorry, it's me, Cam. <laughs> I'm coming to meet you tomorrow. We're gonna pull together. Okay, well, I think now we're pretty well researched, fully equipped. What's the next step? We're going, going to Sydney. Sydney. Cue the travel montage. Whoa. To chug a chug a big red car. We'll travel near and we'll travel far. To to chug a chug a big red car. We're gonna ride the whole day long. All right, we're in Sydney. Woo. What's the next stop? We are going to Murray Wiggles' house. Uh oh. Why are we going to Murray Wiggles' house, Des? Because we're going to make a song. So you're telling me we're going to meet Murray Wiggle, make a song with him, and then perform it in the next three hours? It feels like not a whole lot of time to make a song, right? Why do you look so nervous, man? Um, what gives it away that I'm nervous? All right, this is the venue for tonight's performance. Pretty, pretty heavy metal, isn't it? Correct. I don't know if this is the exact Wiggles vibe. <laughs> We're the right address. And okay. Tris is gonna tear out that drum kit in about two hours. I just wanted to take a quick eight second announcement to let you know that our new Seek Discomfort collection, Breathe, is out now on seekdiscomfort.com. These designs serve as a reminder to pause and take a breath and to connect with nature and each other. Starting the walk to Murray Wiggles house. I still can't believe that. It's only started happening like two days ago. It's all come together. Hi! Hi, Hi Mari! Wow, hey. How are you? Hey, man, I'm Cam. Cam, nice good to meet you. you. Thank oh, you good. for having us over. Yeah, honestly. Yeah. Uh, wow. Yeah, this is where the magic happens. Yeah. Tristan's very confident. Yeah. I'm a little nervous, to be honest. <laughs> what? In your life, because you were pretty young when you started with the Wiggles. Oh, I actually wasn't. I was, um, I was already, I was thirty. I was oh, really? Thirty when I started. So, what led you to be to saying, okay, we're all really, really good musicians. Now we want to be a kids children's band. Well, it, it was kind of organic, really, because like towards the end of the eighties, I decided that um, music wasn't going to be my career, so I thought I had to do something else. So yeah, so I decided to do teaching, and I, I went um, and studied early childhood education. Anthony was doing the course as well, so I met him there. Uh, later on, Greg came along as well. So three of us were trained preschool teachers, basically. 
and when you do that it's it's a bit different to primary teaching so we then we just put that together with the fact we were musicians and uh, we did a what we thought was a one-off album for kids in 1991 and um, yeah and so it just kind of gradually grew from there not many people were making a living from um, uh, playing music for children we actually went to an agent she said oh you'll never make a living out of it there's too many of you <laughs> with right. four people you said, what? <laughs> <laughs> one of our early shows in the US was in the um, parking lot of a, block, a blockbuster video store oh, wow. Wow. and there were four people there <laughs> and I think it was only about a year later we played Madison Square oh my wow. gosh so we went pretty quick yeah, yeah. Wow. It was, that was because of the D Disney Channel we got on the Disney Channel oh, and they, wow. they really just flogged it my mum also wanted me to personally tell you from her to thank you for partially raising me and my two brothers <laughs> and would it be crazy to get an official Murray oh, or son? Oh wow. Is this to you? This to me, Cam. <laughs> <laughs> I mean my son, uh, Cam. <laughs> so now that I had my merchandise signed, it was time to learn how to write a children's song with the expert himself. When it comes to writing um, children's songs, how do you how, how do you go about it? Like for concepts? Yeah, some songs like um, fruit salad. Anthony said he was just walking around the shop and um, there was some fruit salad and he just started singing and he said fruit salad, yummy, yummy. yummy. <laughs> he decided to show Murray a song idea from yesterday, Dancing in the Kitchen, and he liked the idea. So that's what we decided to work on. It can be cool if it's like something for people to join in on, so it's like, shake the salt shaker. Can we dance stuff that isn't using the utensils too? Can we just like, wave your hands in the air? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh. Touch your toes. Yeah. Oh. 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 <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, you've just written your first hit. Wow. A yeah. hit children's song, Dancing in the Kitchen, was now written, and after a quick practice run, we were ready to head to the venue, where over a hundred Yes Fan members were already waiting. <laughs> I was like, do not wear red in front of me. I know, I don't want to. No, I don't want to. <laughs> Are you ready? Are you nervous? Are you nervous? Yeah. Don't you be nervous. Don't yeah. be nervous. I know, you guys are pros, so you'll, you'll, you'll carry me through it. We all get nervous our first time, don't worry. Don't worry. Uh, let's be out there, right? Let's put on a show. What Mary does let's best. Let's put on a show! Yeah! <laughs> and so, after a long 24 hours of preparation and training with the best, we were finally ready to become with us. <laughs> From Melbourne this morning. We had this funny idea, I don't know why, that we wanted to be in a children's entertainment band for 24 hours. And we wanted to write an original children's song and perform it live for all your 24 hour period. And uh, we had the help of a very special someone today to help us write a children's song and have to perform with us. He's an expert in the field. Are you all know who he is? Please give a warm hand to Murray Cook. <laughs> This song's called Dancing in the Kitchen. <laughs> Look, I want you guys to listen to the lyrics, join in, sing along, dance along. Hey, we're here for a good time. Dancing in the kitchen, hoppity hop. We're dancing in the kitchen, hoppity hop. We're dancing in the kitchen, hoppity hop. We're dancing in the kitchen, hoppity hop. Put your hands in the air and wave them around. Stomp your feet on like a big sound. Put your hands on your side. We had only planned to perform Dancing in the Kitchen, but Murray couldn't let us leave without playing a few Wiggle songs. We'd done it. We'd really done it. In the space of 24 hours, we gotten ourselves here, fulfilling a lifelong dream by performing alongside the legend himself and original wiggle, Murray Cook. Hey! 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 
It had been a dream come true. And more than just teaching us to be children's entertainers, Murray had inspired us with the wisdom from his experiences. We started it as a hobby. We didn't think it was going to be a career, and now it's <laughs> yeah. like for over 30 years. I think the, one of the things that connected with people too is that we were genuine about what we were doing. We, yeah. we weren't going, oh, you know, this is going to be, make us lots of money because we had no idea when we started. I think sometimes when you're pursuing a dream, you can get bogged down in the details or stress about the little things. But Murray reminded us that one of the keys to his and the rest of the Wiggles' success was to do something you love and have fun doing it. And we couldn't agree more. In fact, the fun wasn't quite over. I could also play anything you wanted to do on drums too. Sure, I, sure. I hear you play me and ACDC. I could die right now. I could die a happy man. 